Hello everyone, it's your girl again, Dr. Solomon Onazi, aka Mama Budwa. Yeah, welcome to this great day. I am glad to connect with you again. Yeah, wherever you're watching from, I just want you to know that I love and I appreciate you. I quickly want to talk about love. When you're in love with someone, genuinely, you love someone to disrespect, to disobey, to do anything evil will be very, very difficult. It will be easy to, to do, to do, to do good. It will be easy to obey. It will be easy to respect the person. What am I saying in essence? Let us try as much as possible to be in love with whoever you are in love with. Genuine love. When you're in love and you say, move this way. No, I am not saying that you should be a robot. Move like this, you move. But when you're in love genuinely, when you say go like this, when she say like this, you, you quickly agree. It's easy for you to agree, to obey, and to flow above all. You just see yourself just smiling unnecessarily. You just remember this person, you're just smiling. Beloved, are you really in love with your spouse? Are you really in love with that man, with that woman you call your husband, your wife? It's not late. In case it's difficult for you to fall in love, in love, in love, in love again, ask God for grace. There is nothing that is too big or too small to ask God. Just ask God for the grace. And in case you are falling out of love, ask God to give you the grace to go back to the first place that you receive one another. What I'm saying again is, let us try to remain in love genuinely when you're in love with your spouse it will be difficult to deny one another of the marital bliss marital rights you just everything will just be easy so my people in case you are falling out of love ask god for grace in case you are still struggling to fall in or to remain or to obey or to to to, to do all, all those things just ask God for grace. The person you're in love with, please stay focused. I love you and I will always love you. Me, I love my bubble. That's why the guy didn't dust the gate to me. So I come your way again, I remain your one and only Dr. Solomon, a.k.a. Bye for now.